If anything makes you angry, upset, sad, drop it. Isn't that intelligence? Understand very clearly. There is something extraordinary here. Allow it to happen to you. Don't be with logic. Your logical reasoning will not work. Only listening will work. Listening is the magic wand. You can use it and experience it. But if you don't listen, you will just be, why is this not right? Why is that not right? I don't like this. I don't like that. What is happening is going. Hey, you ask. When the minute the thought comes, it is boring, I don't like it, I am so upset, is it making me happy? Hey, don't play with me. If it's not making me happy, it is not me. Do you understand this? If it is not making me happy, I am dropping it. That's what I did to him. I asked him only one question. First, I didn't give him grief. I didn't tag him the carrot. No, he was so angry. He said, I want to pull my nose out. And eyes full of water. But he has promised me he will not cry. Not me. Promised. It's, uh, that is the difference. When you give promise, it's not for others. For yourself. So, that one key I had, now I have to be carefully with that key. That is the right understanding that he has. Now what I told him, is it making you happy pulling out the nose? Immediately you hate him. Of course it's not making him happy. As the man thinks, happy, making you, trying to make you happy. There is this thought which wants to pull out the nose, which is making you happy. Ah, wait. He took his hand out and said, Mahatma, tears just disappeared. See, the minute you said, I said, whenever you're angry, say, I want to be happy. I want to say. Immediately your thought came. See how it plays with you. I want to sit here. I want my cup. So see, is it making you happy again? Ask this question. Be, this is the only question the incompletion cannot say. When you are very clear about the declaration, the incarnation, the ego will not affect, the logic will not affect. Only logic affects if you support it. 